Aloha friends, it's Robert Stelic. Welcome to the boardroom at the Blue Planet Surf Shop in Haleiwa on Oahu's North Shore. In today's video, I'm gonna go over our new 2023 Blue Planet Tough Tech models. These boards are as durable as ever, easy to use and affordable. So it's a really nice combination of lightweight, strength and affordability. So our Tough Tech models are available in many different models and colors and we'll go over those after I talk about the features. So first of all, let's talk about all the features of these boards. One thing that's different from our older models on the 2023 models is the rails are painted. So instead of using tape, which on our older boards we had rail tape, on these new boards uh, we have painted rails. So the painted rails are more durable. They can't slide off or peel off over time. So um, the painted rails are a nicer finish for these boards. Another difference on our newer boards, the gray ones have the white deck. So we found that the bamboo finish over time, if, if you leave it out in the sun a lot, it does fade, fade more. And then also the clear coat can peel off a little bit. So by using the white finish, uh, it, it's much more um, UV resistant and lasts longer in the sun. Boards also come with a Lycra board sock. We kind of revamped the packaging to get rid of all plastics. So there's no bubble wrap, it's all cardboard material, recyclable cardboard material. And then on the inside, you'll find this uh, Lycra board sock that's included with each new board. So it's just like a slip on cover that's real easy to take off. You just slide it off the tail and then it just kind of slides right off the nose of the board. So real convenient and environmentally friendly packaging. The Lycra board cover is also really good for UV protection. So if you're gonna leave your board outside in the sun for a while, or if you put it on your car roof outside, we recommend putting it in the Lycra sock to protect it from UV rays. And it also provides a little bit of protection from scuffs and scratches and dirt and so on. For more information on these Lycra board socks, you can also watch the video up here or in the description down below where we go over the features and how to use it. So our boards also come with four leash plugs in the front here, on uh, the front third of the board. And it has a deck pad underneath this area as well. So it comes with this elastic band that you can use to strap down equipment like uh, snorkeling gear or water bottles and t whatever, picnic, lunch or something like that. For cruising, touring, this is a great feature. And then on the front of the board, these gray ones we designed specifically for board rental operations. So these ones have a hole through, through the nose here. It's a, um, made so you can put a lock on the board. Um, basically, a lot of operations have the boards laying flat on the beach and then um, you can just run a cable lock through them to lock them all together. Okay, so I'm gonna talk a little bit about the construction of these Tough Tech boards. It's basically a molded construction, so it's a thermal molded skin on the outside, and it's made up of ABS plastic and polycarbonate. Polycarbonate is also used on the bottom of skis and snowboards. It's very scratch resistant, very durable. So the outer skin is a really impact resistant and scratch resistant shell. And then the inside is more kind of like a traditional surfboard with fiberglass and EPS foam core and epoxy. Um, and then around the rails, it has a Kevlar band. So it has these Kevlar rails, a, a band of Kevlar that runs all the way around the rails, nose and tail of the board. So that protects the impact, high impact areas. Kevlar is also used in imp, uh, bulletproof vests. So it's very resilient material and um, it protects the rails of the board. Underneath the deck, we also have extra reinforcements for the standing area. And then there's also extra reinforcements around the fin boxes and the inserts. So let's have a look at the other side of the board. Flip it over for you. Bottom is all white. So if you do leave it in the sun, we recommend leaving it upside down just to prevent heat damage. The white stays cooler in the sun. Uh, has the dimensions, the logos on the bottom. And then in the back here, we have a three fin setup. Fins are included. If you're just paddling flat water, you can just use a single center fin. But in the surf, we recommend also using the side fins. That helps you with uh, turn, turning and maneuverability of the board. So looking at the bottom of this board, it has a nice continuous rocker line 
which makes the board handle really smoothly. It's bit, we've been refining the rocker lines over many years, but there's a little bit more tail rocker, flatter surface in the middle for glide and speed, and then a nice nose rocker. And then the bottom shape, there's a slight concave in the nose that helps with lift in the nose, and then a more or less flat in the center and a V in the tail. The V helps it kind of go rail to rail while the flatter surface in the middle allows the board to kind of turn e more easily and as acts more neutral. So over the last few years, we've been selling a lot of these Tough Tech models. They are our best sellers. They're ideal for beginners and intermediate paddlers. Just the combination of durability, lightweight and affordability make them great, a great choice for almost anyone. That's why they've been selling really well. And these are our new and improved models. At Blue Planet, we believe in continuous improvement, so we always try to find ways to make our best products even better. So all our Blue Planet Tough Tech models come in three different colors. Uh, you can see them right here. This is the blue colorway, the gray colorway, and the teal colorway. And each of the board ha boards have a matching Polynesian stripe that matches the deck pad color of the board. And then we have many different models. In the standard paddle boards, we have a 9.8, 10.2, 10.6, 11.0, and 11.6 model. And then we also have two surfboard models, the 9.6 longboard and a 12-foot longboard. So the smallest board in our Tough Tech standard paddle board lineup is the Holo Moana model. It's this one right here. The length is 9 foot 8 by 32 inches wide by 176 liter volume. So this is a nice board for people, beginners that are a little bit on the lighter weight side. I would say less than 190 pounds or so. Um, for intermediate or advanced paddlers, um, bigger, heavier um, paddlers can use it as well. So it's a kind of a good second board for a heavier intermediate paddler or a good first board for a lighter weight or like a petite female or child this is a nice board to get started on. This is our 10-2 Polynesian Warrior model. This is a nice all-round board, great shape. This is actually has been our best-selling model at Blue Planet. It's 10 foot 2 long by 32 wide, 181 liters. So this is very user-friendly, great all-round board. Has kind of a rounded pintail shape which makes it good in the surf, so you can surf it, but it's also a great board for just cruising, flat water paddling. The thick rails and 32 inch width makes it nice and stable. So it's a great choice for all round conditions, average weight paddlers. For bigger, heavier paddlers, we recommend our bigger 11 foot model. This model here is the 106 by 33 Polynesian Voyager model. It has 220 liters of volume, so a nice amount of volume. It has kind of a pretty straight outline, so it's a good cruising board, and it has kind of a squared off squash tail, which makes it nice and stable in the tail. So this one is our 11.6 Polynesian Touring model. It's more like of a cruising touring board. It's great for flat water paddling. This board tracks really well. The dimensions are 11 foot six, by 31 and a half by 290 liters. So it also has kind of a wider tail, pretty straight outline. And then the bottom has a, a kind of a pointy nose in the front, which uh, helps it kind of displace the water, slices through the water really well. So um, it has a relatively low rocker line, relatively flat. So it's a good board for paddling longer distances, cruising, cutting through chop. So this model is the 110 by 35 Polynesian Ohana. It's uh, one of our most stable boards and the most popular board for beginners because it's very stable. Uh, it, you know, it's at 35 inches wide, so it's got a lot of side to side stability. It also has 250, uh, 250 liters of volume, which is nice and uh, big enough to you know, for a bigger, heavier person or for two people to go on the board at the same time. So this is a great choice if you just want a nice cruiser model. 
So our Tough Tech surfboards, this is the 9.6 and we also have a 12 foot model. These are great for entry level surfers and for rental fleets, same durability, super solid construction and uh, nice shapes for, especially for entry level surfers. And I have a video that you can watch up here just on the 9.6 longboard. When you buy one of these boards at our shop, we'll also include a full package deal. So you get a free aluminum adjustable oval shaft paddle. These are really nice paddles with our Kaizen nylon blade. It's adjustable, really nice system, uh, great entry level paddle. So the boards include one of our jumbo leashes. These are really nice durable leashes and that's included as well. So when you buy the Tough Tech package at our shop, it includes everything you need to get started. A leash, a paddle, fins, deck pad of course, and the board. So if you're not sure which model is right for you, I'll have a link up here and also in the description down below to a video that will help you choose the right board for your needs. Then we also have our staff here in the shop which is very helpful at helping you choose the right board and you can try before you buy. At our rental deck we'll let you try all the different models and you can apply the rental fee towards the purchase of your board. So there's lots of options available. Thanks for watching this video on our newest Tough Tech models. I hope you enjoyed it. If you found it helpful please give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to the Blue Planet Surf YouTube channel and we'll see you on the water. Aloha.